Cynthia! Vanquisher of evil! My sword has judged you and found you wanting! Heh, <laughs> nice! I'm totally using that next time out! You seem as chipper as ever, Cynthia. I feel energized just watching you. Hey, if I got anything to offer, it's Pep. Belting out catchphrases and awesome hero speeches always gets me going. So that's your secret, is it? Yep, if you're ever feeling worn down, I can't recommend it highly enough. Hey, you should try it right now. All right, maybe I will. Let's see. I am Morgan, the, um, unwavering light that makes bad guys really sad. Well? Hey, that does feel good. I bet with a little bit of practice, I could really get used to this. Oh, yay! It's always good to find someone who appreciates the art of heroism. <laughs> it does seem like we're something of a match pair. And that means it's up to us to keep the speeches coming till everyone is energized. <laughs> Look out, world! I'm gonna shout at you until I'm hoarse! Cynthia? Do they really? But that would mean... Is... everything alright? Oh, hi Morgan. I don't think I've ever seen you this... drained. Is something on your mind? No, I'm... Well, yes, actually. Lately, it seems like the others have all been... staring at me. Uh, do you mean more than usual, or what? Well, I'm used to them watching, but not, you know, staring. It's been happening when I give heroic pep talks. People always look, but... But? But whenever I do it lately, people just stare. A lot. And hard. It's like they're born into my soul with two javelins of shame and regret. No, oh, that's just your imagination, I'm sure. No, it's not. They pity me, Morgan. They're all embarrassed for me. And so now that's all I can think about. I can't even fight anymore. Seriously. I almost got stabbed by a blind coacher on a horse the other day. Then I propose a little experiment. If your heroic boldness is too much for them, why not try acting meek? In our next battle, take the field as quiet, demure Cynthia. Then watch the reactions and draw conclusions from the experience. Yeah, but... what will that tell me? <laughs> if they're fed up with how rambunctious you are, they'll be glad you quieted down. But if they like your usual peppy self, they'll clearly be worried about you. Jeez! I'm not sure I even know how to act demure. Just think about your mother. Try to act as she would. Alright, I'll give it a try. Wonderful. We'll have your answer in no time. I guarantee it. Hey, Cynthia. Morgan. So, how goes it? Have you mastered acting meek and demure yet? Yes. Uh, right. You know I'm not sure that's actually how Demir works. Maybe you just need a little more time? Yes, I'm sure that's it. No, that isn't... necessary. I can actually feel myself growing old waiting for you to finish a sentence. I'm starting to think this is a bad idea. What? No way! I practice really hard! Look! I'll even show you my demure face! <laughs> Please stop that. Uh, all this aside though, how have the others reacted to this new you? Aw, that was really sweet. They were all very concerned. They kept coming up to me and asking me what was wrong. Oh? Oh yeah! People are all running up and shouting at me and stuff. What is wrong with you, Cynthia? You look upset, Cynthia! Why do you keep making that horrible face, Cynthia? So, if what you said is true, 
That means they all missed the old perky me, right? Uh, right. I'm sure that's what they meant. They all want you to be yourself. Your happy, energetic, very loud self. Hey! It's such a relief to know for sure. Oof! All that worrying how my stomach did not. But now that it's over, I'm hungry. Want to grab something to eat? I think they're potch today. Sure. It must be hard being energetic on an empty stomach after all. I know, right? Come on, let's go! Eesh, between the pauses in that face, it's no wonder people thought her ill. I doubt it had anything to do with her missing pep and verb. Not that I could tell her that without breaking her heart, though. Oh well, at least she's smiling again. Morgan! Um, hi? You're not! Hiding anything from me, are you? What makes you say that? Oh please, it's written all over your face! I really have no idea what you're... The real reason everyone was worried when I was acting demure! Out with it! Ah, uh, that... I knew it! You knew I was wrong, and you just let me believe it! You said everyone's concerned about me meant they missed the old me! You lied to me! It wasn't a lie. It was a... I mean, I... Wait, how did you come to the conclusion that the others didn't miss the old you? Someone asked if I was feeling better, and I said yep, and then they said... Good! The funny talking had us worried it was permanent brain damage. You've always been crazy, but this time we worried you finally snapped. This is your fault, Morgan! I made an even bigger fool of myself than before! I'm sorry, Cynthia. I, really, I am. I didn't mean to lie. Then why did you... Because I miss the old you. The crazy girl with all the speeches and moves. So the others may not get it. So what? They were still concerned for you. But me? I just missed you. You, Cynthia. I think you're awesome. Morgan... I love your energy, Cynthia. I love your heroic nature. I... I love you! You what? I only realized it once you were gone. Uh, once you went Demir, I mean. But... Once it happened, I didn't know how to tell you without hurting you. And then, when you changed back, I didn't want to change your mind about why. So I didn't. I was a coward and I just... hoped everything would work out. I forgive you. Y you do? I looked like a fool, and you just confess that you're in love with me. I think that evens the old embarrassment scales, don't you? Cynthia... Yes, it may have been embarrassing, but in the end, I'm glad it happened. Uh, really? Yes, because it led me to someone who really loves me for who I am. I hope you know what you're getting into. I can be kind of loud sometimes. <laughs> I kind of noticed, but I'd have it no other way. <clears throat> By the mighty sword of Morgan, I shall love you forever. Hey! That was actually pretty good! <laughs>